Hi, my name is Elizabeth Cristalusi. I publish a blog called Tech for Luddites, providing tips and tricks for navigating our digital world. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do AdWords coding in your WordPress blog or website. Before we do the actual coding, I want to clarify, uh, when we talk about ads, there's AdWords and AdSense. And the difference is, AdWords is if you want to advertise your business on another company's website, you're going to use the Google AdWords service. If you want other people to advertise their services and products on your website, you want to use the Google AdSense service. And that is something, you know, you go into Google and set up an account and go to AdSense, it will walk you through everything you need to know about create, uh, creating spaces on your website to put those ads. Uh, so we're not going to go over all of that. But I've already created a number of ads in Google AdSense. The different sizes, different color schemes, you can create all sorts. And I've designed them so that they will fit into my website and, or into my blog. And I'm going to show you two different places that you could incorporate them in your blog that are very popular. One is to put them right inside a blog post or a web page. And so I've created this one, it's a medium rectangle, it's 300 by 250 pixels. And you can see where the list of, this is on the AdSense page under my ads. You can see under the list, it has these uh, links to get code. So uh, it's as simple as that I go, I click get code and it gives me everything I, I just need to click in. It automatically highlights the whole thing and I use control C, so I've now copied that. Now, when I go back to my WordPress dashboard and I click, uh, I, I, I want to create a new post, let's say, and I want to put the ad in that. I just, you have to be on the, this is very important. You need to be on the text tab. It won't work if you're on the visual tab. So move, click over to the text tab and just paste in that code that you just copied. Uh, it has all the information it needs and I'm going to save the draft and we'll just preview it, quickly preview it. And there you go. Now you can see this, there's an ad in here right now. Now I will tell you that sometimes it might take a few minutes before a, an ad comes up uh, because um, Google kind of needs time to look over the page and decide what would be relevant or to collect information about the user that's visiting the page so that they display an ad that makes sense for that particular visitor. Um, so, but it usually doesn't take more than about 10 minutes. So you should see something fairly quickly. Um, and then, uh, so that's how you could put it right into a blog post or a web page. You can do that on, on any page. Uh, the other way is to put it into a widget in your sidebar. And uh, to do that, because my sidebar is not so wide, I've actually got a different size. I'm using one called Wide Skyscraper for that. Again, I just click for the code. Click in to select it, control C to copy it. And I will go back to uh, my dashboard and I will go over to my uh, appearance, under the navigation, I go from appearance to widgets. And I'm going to add a text widget, which lets you also put HTML, which is really what this code is. I'm not going to add a title. I don't want anything above the ad. Uh, so again, I'm just going to paste in the code exactly as I took it from the Google AdSense page. Uh, I, I don't need to add paragraphs. I'm just going to save that. And now I'm going to go over to my website or my blog. And I'm going to reload the page. And when I scroll down, there's that skyscraper ad. Now again, depending on the content you have on your page, it could be a few minutes before it shows up, but it won't take very long. There, now you know how to add Google AdWords into your WordPress website or blog. I hope you found this video helpful. I'm Elizabeth Crispalusi with Tech for Luddites. Thanks for watching and have a great day.